Well, I've been hearing some parts of the country have had their heaviest snowfalls in years. One good thing, though, was that the forecasters had been predicting it for days. The BBC's forecaster, John Hammond, is with me. So, John, why has the snow been so heavy this time? Yeah, peculiar spell, and there's, there's good reasons. There's something peculiar going on in the atmosphere, actually, Fiona. Researchers at uh, the Met Office have been keeping an eye on something for weeks now. It's called a sudden stratospheric warming. Now, what that means is that way up at the top of the atmosphere, uh, where it's normally very cold, particularly in wintertime, unusually it suddenly warms. And what that effect of that is that normally when we get sort of westerly winds uh, at the top of the atmosphere, it gets reversed. Uh, the winds start coming from the other direction. And that tends to percolate its way down the atmosphere so that the jet stream, which is normally what brings us you know, mild, wet and windy weather in from the west, that gets slowed and eventually blocked. And that's not good news for the UK because we rely on those mild westerly winds to keep us you know, relatively unextreme in winter. However, once that jet stream gets blocked, that opens the gates to colder easterly winds coming in off Scandinavia. And that's exactly what's happened over the last week or so. Now, this is quite an important area of research, Fiona, because uh, we now have the capability to predict these stratospheric warmings. And that's what happened around about Christmas time. We could see this coming down the tracks. So we could prepare for this winter spell. We knew it was coming. The question is, how long is it going to last? Well, although the stratospheric warming has tended to wane over the last few days, its effects down at the surface last quite a lot longer. So the answer to the question that everybody wants to know the answer to, how long is it going to last? Um, well, certainly for several days, we've still got that blocked cold easterly, so expect uh, more bitter weather and the prospect of more snow as those Atlantic weather systems try to come in, but then they get blocked by that cold air coming in from the east. So a battleground across the UK, moisture and cold equals snow. Fascinating, John. Thanks very much.